I am Brian King, Chancellor of the Four Los Rios Colleges, American River College, Cosumnes River College, Folsom Lake College, and Sacramento City College. As flowers begin to bloom and trees begin to bud this spring in the Capital Region, the Los Rios Colleges are also enjoying a wonderful renewal this spring. We have much to celebrate together, and I want to express a profound attitude of gratitude to the thousands of staff and faculty who have worked so hard on behalf of our students to make our many successes possible. Thank you so much. Los Rios is recognized across California as a premier community college district because of you. I am proud that because of your efforts, Los Rios is among the leaders in the state of California in restoring access that was lost during the years of the global pandemic. At one point, our enrollment during the pandemic dropped by an astounding 23%. Due to your amazing work, we are on track to fully restore access lost during the pandemic, possibly as early as this coming fall semester. This is an amazing shared accomplishment. Another wonderful cause for celebration is that all four of our colleges recently went through the accreditation process with flying colors. Our colleges not only receive full accreditation without conditions for the maximum seven year period, we did so with numerous commendations and no ongoing recommendations to meet standards. We understand the excellence of our colleges, but this kind of external validation of excellence is always nice. Fiscal stability has been a hallmark of the Los Rios Community College District for generations, and our sound planning and budgeting across the district remains the envy of many of our sister districts in California. We are so fortunate to have a seven-person elected board of trustees that places a high priority on stability and fiscal prudence. In recent years, Los Rios has been able to provide our employees with substantial increases in base salary as well as retro payments, a reflection of sound financial planning and leadership. Within the constraints of the state budget, we remain committed to providing fair compensation for all of our employees. And while addressing employee compensation needs, Los Rios has also fully restored its budget reserves to be ready when that next rainy day comes. As much as we enjoy the current season of spring, sunshine, and renewal at our colleges, we also recognize that storm clouds may be gathering on the horizon. As you have probably heard or read, the California Legislative Analyst Office, sometimes known as the LAO, is estimating that state revenues are currently coming in at 73 billion, less than what is needed to meet all state expenditures. That's right, 73 billion with a B. In several weeks, Governor Newsom will release the May revise to the proposed budget year that begins on July 1, 2024. As has always been the case at Los Rios, we will hope for the best, and plan pragmatically and collaboratively for every possible outcome in the budget in the coming months. Our commitment to fiduciary excellence, coupled with our Healthy Rainy Day Fund, has us better prepared to weather the next several years than practically any other multi-college district in the state of California. This principled approach isn't exciting, but it is foundational to what has allowed Los Rios to protect our people when others around the state were unable to do so. We will continue to focus on the values that make us strong, our interest-based approach chief among them. Even as the world around us seems more turbulent and polarized at times, especially heading into a presidential election year, our shared values will serve as our North Star. Those shared values help guide our operational and financial planning, and they also frame our commitment to our students particularly students of color and students from marginalized or historically underserved communities. These values guide our equity work and our work to improve student outcomes together. And they guide us through difficult conversations, like how to not just meet the letter of the law when it comes to the Native American Graves and Protection Act, also known as NAGPRA, but to truly work with our tribal partners to right historical wrongs. During the spring semester, I have had wonderful opportunities to meet with students, staff, and faculty at all four of our colleges at a variety of events, including college office hours and brown bag meetings open to everyone. I have also been able to attend inspiring events like the recent annual AMEN conference with its focus on transforming our colleges to better beat the needs 
of our students of African descent. Thanks so much to everyone who has taken the time to come and have a conversation together. I look forward to many more opportunities to meet with you face to face in the future, now that thankfully the world of Zoom only interactions is fading into a distant memory. I am so honored to serve as Chancellor of the Los Rios Colleges. Our four colleges form a wonderful, large, diverse, and beautifully complicated community that is relentlessly focused on putting students first. We are all part, part of an important calling, the calling to come together to help our students transform their lives through the power of education. Please let me know any way I, as your chancellor, can help you in our shared commitment to serving the incredible students at our colleges. Best wishes for a wonderful completion to the spring semester.